Now this video solves finally the problem which I got with my bootstrap installing bootstrap into my um, in my Android application. So when I watch my Android application, I did like always, I, like all the other people did in our videos, we install our application. So we go to our uh, to our npm system. We stop the surf. Control C, and then we go to install uh, Bootstrap. So if you say bootstrap, then it's always the latest version, but I may, may also take the version 4. I do nothing in this case. I say just in my file, I'm using the version 4. So you should, should see here it's bootstrap for uh, 3.4.1, uh, 3 which is the latest one in this case and it should work so we also have here some stuff which is error button tag uh, not terminated so this is some error inside uh, we come to this later now we start again with our application we say here ng surf now our system will run again but when we are here in our application Let's go there, modules. We, we will find here some bootstrap. You see, here's the bootstrap, dist, CSS, bootstrap file. That's what we have there. And here's our min version, and we see 3.4.1, which is not bad. And now, when we go to, when we try to Im implement something in our site, uh, we have to first to go into our uh, where is it here into our Angular file, Angular JSON. And in the JSON file, we go to projects. This is my current project, Arch architect, build, and then we have styles. And in there, as always, we have to embed here this uh, node modules, bootstrap, dist, CSS, bootstrap, min, CSS. So this should work, and it works somehow. So in this case, when we have uh, some stuff like the buttons here, I have uh, here on our file is component HTML. That's my block, what I have there. So when you take the example from the here from my bootstrap file, get bootstrap buttons, uh, boot, bootstrap, buttons, button danger. So you will find this one's bootstrap buttons. Now you have here a big block and you may copy that block, this one. Now you, when you go in your file and say, okay, um, I want to see what's going on there. Now say control V, uh, control S for saving. I saw that saving. And now you see somehow this works it looks like the same like it is in here. That's okay. Not completely secondary is missing as I see. This one is gray, okay. Uh, it's similar. Uh, now, but now when you have different, uh, when I had some problem with my input group, with my forms, I see this one. And this one didn't work when I want something like this or when I sh want to shorten that point, I go to copy and say okay now I want to see what this is doing let's make here a button return so this is different uh, a return line and now we take also a return big block so we Im implement now this one we say control s for save you see our application now this one is not the same as you see this one's there and we have it here so, and that's completely different. Uh, as you see, this is one line. And what we may do in this case is we have to go here to getting started. And then we say, uh, 
we should embed it with a link uh, style sheet. Let's now uh, the version four. What I see there. Now I go into my file. My that's my HTML file. And at the beginning of this file, before there's anything else, I say head. Uh, head. Make that point now inside the head I'm pasting my new stuff now when I save it I will see here my stuff and now this happens now it works and this looks fine it looks like uh, that stuff before here it's like this one maybe a little bit closer um, and this is the solution that if you can't get it running in your uh, in your node mo node modules, and I even try to embed it with my version four, so when I say this one is, uh, if I mark it out, you see it, it doesn't work anymore. And now when I go to when I stop with my server and. Uh, Control C stops the machine. Then we go to install and now we install the version 4. This one install and save version 4. We should be okay. Bootstrap 3.4. So now we have Bootstrap 4.5.3. And now when I start it again, and she surf, now it should run, run npm audit fix. So this is, there were some failures, but these were minor failures. Now when I save this one again, first I go into my bootstrap, now we go to bootstrap, we have a look on it again. Where's my min version? Now we see in, inside there, we have the version 4.5.3. Now this one should work, but it will not. And now when we go to our HTML file, and when we rerun it, now it's working. Damn. Now that's the reason why what we had to do, either implementing uh, this one with the head, or install it uh, explicit, explicitly with the um, with the operator four. So this is uh, the latest version. What I couldn't get out, find out. So this was explicitly run it with this at four so you have the latest version uh, when you only run it with this one you get the version three the latest version uh, from the system itself three point uh, the latest which is installed in that st stuff